Hi everyone and welcome to this video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use the priority inbox. Let's get started. The first thing that I want to clarify with you guys is what the priority inbox is. Priority Inbox is sort of like a tool that Gmail um, has that can help you prioritize your emails. You know, every day we receive so many emails and we can get a, have a tendency to get lost or, um, yeah, not really know what you really need to do today and so on. So the Priority Inbox will actually help you to structure your incoming emails. Now, the first thing that you need to do if you do want to put a priority inbox in place is to think about all your incoming emails. How do you want to structure your inbox? Do you want to create a specific uh, view on everything that you need to do, everything that you need to follow up, all your emails that you haven't um, dealt with yet? You know, just think about what is it that incomes in your inbox and how you would like to structure it to make it more effective and productive for you. What I'll be doing is I'll be creating two categories. I'll create a category for all of the emails that I have to deal with today. And I'm going to create a, a category of all the emails that I have to follow up on. Okay. The first thing that you need to do is to think about that. The second thing that you need to do is create labels that actually match these categories you'll be creating. So let's go ahead. I hope that you remember how to create a label. So let's go on more, create a new label, and I'm going to create a label that is called to do. Then I'm going to go ahead and create another label called follow up. All right, my label to do is over here. I'm gonna give it a color that I will um, not forget and follow up here is going to be yellow and here they are. Now, that was step number two, create labels that will refer to the sections you will be putting together. Now let's go and set this all up into our settings. Let's go to settings here under the wheel and then settings. And then once you're in here, click on inbox. As you see here, the inbox type at the moment is default. We would like to change that. So click on default and hit that priority inbox drop down option. Here are the four sections I was uh, talking about. As you can see, you can only go for four sections not um, more than that. So the first section, I actually want to see all of my unread emails. I think that's the first thing that I kind of want to go through in the morning is go through everything that I haven't um, dealt with. Then I want to see everything that I has labeled as um, to do. As you saw, you come here on the drop down menu, go under more options, and then you choose the label of your choice and we chose to do. Third section is all of those emails that I have to follow up on. So if I go here under a section and if I go to more options, I have to go here and select the follow up label. And as you can see, it starts lining up quite nicely. Um, section four is actually by default, so I can't really replace it by um, with um, another label. This is always going to be everything else. So everything else is an email that you have opened up that you've read, but you haven't really classified yet or you haven't labeled it as um, um, to do or follow up or you haven't archived yet. Okay. Now, once you're happy with this, let's go ahead and save the changes that we have made with this button down below. And let's take a look at what it looks like. So we have the unread category that is over here and that matches what we have. There are two emails that I have not read. Then the all um, to-do category is empty. Obviously, I haven't labeled anything um, with the to-do label. So I'm gonna go ahead and label these two emails with the to-do. As you can see here, 
as I click on my to do section, I have here those two emails that I have labeled as to do. So these are the two things I still need to um, finish up today. Then the follow up se section is, of course, still empty. Let's just say this is a follow up email that I have to keep track of. If I go here now, I have the email follow up that appears and everything else is just below here. So I still haven't kind of looked into this email here yet and I'm not quite sure what I need um, to do with it. So I can just um, close up that category and there you go. Look at that. Your inbox is prioritized. Instead of looking at all the unread emails, I can just close up that section so that I don't see it, I don't get distracted by it, and focus on all the emails that I have to do and to finalize today. So this is how you can enable and set up the priority inbox in your Gmail today. Let me know if you have any questions or if you have any doubts, uh, and I'll be glad to help. Take care and have a nice day.